All right. I figure while I have the camera out, I may as well just show you around my office. So, show you how I do things. So, this is my desk, which is pretty cluttered compared to normal. Um, this right here is just a um, file folder. It has four or five spots. Five spots. Sorry if I'm making you motion sickness. Okay, so um, as most of you know, I do have two um, different businesses um, that I run. Um, so I have a 31 tab. I have a pink zebra tab. I have a file that is to file, orders to submit, and contacts. So this is how I use it. Um, my contacts are going to be like, I know when I get home from a show, um, I'm really tired and I'm, you know, just trying to get stuff in the house. So I put my contact slips in there. Um, I get to get different contacts through the week too. So I just put them all in this folder. And then um, I know who I need to contact for that week. Once I contact them, then they go in here. And their information is going to go in here. And that's when I know that they need to, usually after that folder, they're going to be added to my newsletter. And then here is going to be um, for just to contact them later, like if they weren't added to either a possible hostess list, um, which would go into my zebra arc, or, um, you know, if they want to order, whatever. These are kind of the ones that I didn't really hear from if they didn't get put on the hostess or recruit or need to order lists. Okay, and then my orders to submit are the orders that I've gotten um, through the week that I either need to submit or just submitted. And after I submit the orders, they're going to go over there on that. Can you see it very well? My file folder over there, that organizer from 31. And on the four, on the pockets, if you can see them right there, there's four pockets. And I have file folders in there, manila folders. And one says party submitted. And then the bottom one says party orders. So I'll put the party orders in there. Once it's submitted, then I put it in the party submitted folder. The next side is the outside order folder and then the delivered party order. So I know once they've been delivered, then I need to do my customer care calls. Um, and then after that, then they get filed away. Um, the pink zebra folder is um, just things that I need to um, do. And 31 is usually like my monthly special flyers, um, things like that. And then to file means I need to... Um, put it somewhere other than on my desk. <laughs> so that is my file folder. And then over there, you can see I have three dry erase boards. Um, the top blue one is my 31 board. So um, my parties, um, vendor events, things like that that are upcoming for the month is on there. The purple one is my pink zebra shows and parties. And then in the middle, the pink is a dry erase board. And I got these all at Menards and Walmart. So um, I didn't go anywhere crazy to get that stuff. And so on the monthly board, then I put up um, events and different time things that are going on. Um, upline calls, team meetings, webinars, things like that. Um, what else can I show you while I'm here? Um, let's see. Over here is some of my stock. Um, all of it's kind of put away, ready to go for a vendor event. That's kind of my mixing station. Um, and up there is just more decorations. If we go over here, these are my cabinets. Um, the large one, they just kind of all have a bunch of crap in there that I don't want everybody else to see. <laughs> so it means it's not very organized. Okay, and then over here... Let me get a little bit closer. These, you can see, I still use binders. Um, so over here is, um, I have a hostess arc that I use. Um, I also have an arc um, for when I host team meetings um, that I use. I put all the information in there. Um, different catalogs usually go in that middle one, but it's in a catalog season. Um, customer care binder, I've done a video on that, so you can look at YouTube channel and see where that's at. Um, I have a team binder um, that I use. My 
um, 31 team is in a binder still. And then my pink zebra team is in my arc that I showed you before. Um, and then you can't really see it. So that one says master copies. Okay. And that means that anything that I've printed off, I have a really big problem with going, okay, that was really cute. I printed it off. Now, where did it, you know, where did I save it at? So I always print too often. I put one in the master care binder. And then, so if I need a copy of something, I just pull it out of there and copy it off. And then down below is my sample station and everything that I need for samples to send out. My business cards, um, my cust like when my customers buy and they buy so many, they get one free. Um, everything is in there. So kind of like my mailing station and my sample station um, all in one. So that is how I organize um, my office. Oh, and I've got, can you see my cubes down there? I have that organized. Um, one is full of art supplies. One is full of candle supplies. Um, one is full of um, goodies that I give away at my parties. There's just kind of everything in there. Um, they were organized, not so much now, but that's a really good thing um, to have. And I got that at Target, I believe. And the little cubes I got at Target, too. So that is a look around my office and how I organize things. I know a lot of people have smaller offices or no offices at all. So know that I didn't have this um, the whole time I've been doing direct sales. I've had to, um, we bought a house and I was lucky enough to make a room in the basement in my office. So whatever room you have, you know, make what, do what you can. Um, just make some kind of place where you can sit down and do your business. Um, that's the main point. You don't have to have a big office like this, but that's a tour around my office. See you later.